New York City is one of the top cities in the world for skateboarding. Why am I moving out of New York to try to pursue the skateboarding dream? And I'll be damned if I leave New York without landing my dream tricks. So in this video, we're gonna be trying to land my dream tricks and skate some pretty sick places. At the end of the video, I'm gonna tell you why I'm moving and where. Let's grab some breakfast on our way to the park. Alright guys, we are almost to the park. Let's get the session going and let's land this dream trick. What's good? What's up? I'm here. I'm here on 62, the old man jam. And clearly I'm an old man. <laughs> so we're just getting it as best we can. Oh yeah, absolutely. That's oh, what yeah. we're here to do. Let's go ahead and warm up over here and then we're gonna hit this bowl. I expect the ledge at a transition park to be waxed. Yes. Was I wrong for that? Yes. Was I wrong to try it again? Absolutely. Let's get straight into the session. Let's throw on the helmet and knee pads and let's skate that bolt. Let's start a warm up session in the bowl and then we're gonna try these backside airs. Let's go. Warming up on the shallow end, doing some backside airs. All that's left to do is let's try to take it to the deep end. Let's go. Might have to end the session there, guys, but let's head out of here and then I'm gonna talk to you. Hey guys, I'm so excited. I got a banana peel in my hand. Did my first backside air above coping in the deep section. I'm super pumped. Finally did one before we leave New York City. Tomorrow, we're gonna skate the private band's skate park. Let's go. Alrighty everyone, it is the next day and we are heading to the band's skate park. So I'm just gonna stop chatting, so let's go. Right, guys we are getting closer we're almost to the park so let's see some of the homies and let's just have a good session at the end of the session we're gonna head back home and I'm gonna tell you guys why I'm leaving out of New York to try to pursue skateboarding and where am I moving to let's go That's the homie. It's basically all to kind of ourselves. The session's about to be crazy.
Alright guys, as you can tell, I'm burnt out. <laughs> burnt out, right? Yeah, successful session. I'm gonna wrap it up here. Let me meet you back at the house. Let's go. Alrighty guys, so where did I go? Where am I at? I, along with my fiance, have purchased our first home. We are in North Carolina, as you can see by that giant tree in our front yard. We are in North Carolina. It is raining outside right now, but I'm super excited to be here owning our first house. You know, there's so many opportunities to make out here. And that's kind of where I want to get into why I came out here to become a professional skateboarder. Traditionally in skateboarding, you would always get a sponsor, go on trips, become better at skateboarding. Hopefully you can go from flow to am and then turn pro when they feel like you are ready. But now with YouTube, TikTok, and Instagram, I've taken a whole new approach to skateboarding. It made me realize I might be able to achieve my dreams without taking the traditional skateboarding route. I'm looking at people like John Hill, incredible YouTuber, truly an inspiration. Yes, they've routed for board companies. Yes, they've turned them pro. But it was never the traditional core skateboarding way. And it made me realize if I can move out here, build stuff, contribute to the community, hopefully make a skate park, do a lot of those things, I can be well on my way to that journey as well. So I came out here because yes, I wanna pursue skateboarding, but in a new way, not the traditional way. And I can't wait to take you guys along for the ride. This is Austin here signing out. And like I always, always, always tell you guys, make your dreams a reality. I'll talk to you later. Peace.